What's up everybody? Hey, listen, I know that you've been looking for the perfect chair uh, that you can take backpacking with you that's ultra light. I've got it, I finally found it. Here it is. <laughs> walking down the road and I happen to come across these fine people just chilling in their hammocks, fellow hammock campers. You guys ever take those things out in the woods? Oh yeah. Yep. Yeah. Where do you where do you go? Around here? The gorge. The gorge. Yeah, love, the gorge. love the River Gorge, yeah. Yeah. I've not gone enough this year for sure. Us either. No, either. We, yeah. we haven't been since May. Yeah, it's been a while. I think that's the last time I went actually. Yeah. It's a beautiful day. You guys are enjoying it the right kind of way, man. I know. I'm yeah. worried it'll be the last weather. one for a while. I know. Well, since it's supposed to snow tomorrow, is that? Yeah. Is it really? That's what I heard. I, I don't know. I, I don't ever look at that thing, that app, whatever that thing is. Yeah. I go by the stars. I'm just kidding. Yeah. <laughs> it's not true. It's not true. So Live who's by on the, the moon, love by the sea. Yeah, that's right. Exactly. Who's on the top bunk over there? Uh, sure. Oh, there's Brent. no one. Oh, uh, that was me. Oh. That's you. <laughs> do you do the trick where you like put your foot in and flip or? Have you ever seen that? No, you want to demonstrate? No, <laughs> no, I don't want to. But basically, uh, I will show you kind of like, you just kind of put your foot, your heel in, uh -huh. and then you just kind of turn your body. Back flip yeah. off of it? You start upside down by oh, standing okay. on hers, and then you can work your way up to like four or oh, five wow. of them that way. Yeah, I've climbed up multiple hammers. So you need to be able to do a handstand Never a little that, bit. that maneuver. <laughs> I, I should practice it so I could show people. I could, yeah, you should. But I haven't done that yet. Uh, yeah. The, the older I get, the less the willing I am to do dangerous right. things. The pain is worse. Yeah, yeah, exactly. It really is true that when you come across people that are like-minded, you just get along really, really well. Like I just had a really great conversation with them. I, I'm gonna kind of cut it short because I didn't want to bore you guys with meeting new people, but I just had a great conversation with some really, really cool people that are like-minded, in hammocks, enjoying life. What's up everybody? If you are looking for a backpacking chair that is just the lightest one that I could possibly find on the market, then this is it. I finally found it. Uh, welcome to Hike Life. Uh, Chris Trout here, getting ready to do a quick review on a stool. This stool is fantastic. It only weighs nine ounces and only costs $16, and it is very sturdy. Uh, I weigh just a little under 200 pounds, like 190, and uh, this thing holds me no problem at all. Um, I would recommend it. It is the 7075 aluminum stool. Amazon, I think it's like 16 bucks. Now you can find it other places for 30, but if you actually get the right stool, the aluminum one with the uh, the nice nylon seat, then it's only $16.95, $16 right around that, that price range. That means you're not going out to REI when spending $100 on a chair zero that weighs a pound. So far the lightest chair that I have found is a pound. Uh, they do sell a stool at Field and Stream that's like 15 ounces, which is basically a pound, but for nine ounces, this thing can go in my backpack everywhere. I'm always looking for a good deal on ultralight stuff. I mean, I should buy two of them. I don't think it's gonna break. I mean, it is made of like a solid tent pole kind of aluminum here. I don't think it's going to break, um, but I haven't really put it to the test. So basically, I'm gonna take this on my next backpacking trip and show you guys how it works. I mean, there is nothing better than sitting around a fire with an actual seat. I, I usually bring a Thermarest sit pad that you can get you can get for three dollars on Amazon, but. Um, to have a seat where you can bend your knees properly is super important. Uh, it keeps you off the ground in case it's muddy or wet. Um, you can just be more comfortable overall. Also what I like about it is when you're sure you have a hammock, if you're a hammock camper or even a tent, you can actually sit on it right by your hammock and put your shoes on or get your cooking gear ready. The hammock is super comfortable as a, as a swinging chair, but uh, as a seat, it's nice to have something to sit on right by your campsite so you can maneuver a little bit. What's great about this one is and, and th that you can just kind of fold it up and toss it underneath your, your hammock when you're done or you're, toss it in your tent when you're done or in your vestibule when you're finished with it for the evening. And you don't have to leave it out and fold it up. A lot of those chairs, they'll blow away in the wind. Not this sucker, look at this, Poof, done. So anyway, thank you so much for watching. Uh, oh, so it makes a great necklace. <laughs> thank you so much for watching. If you want to see more reviews, please hit that subscribe button. Hit the like button if you like this video and I'll see you in the next one.
Nah.